I'll kick on to move the mouse and I'll touch the screen. So if it was a tablet, I'm guessing if I was touching it. So yeah, just by moving a mouse over here, if I spin it fast enough, it shouldn't let it go. But if I do go nice and slow, it'll make the items go away, the rectangles go away. And we've got a horse with mountains in the background. And looks like we've got meerkats here as well. So I'll, I'll work my way up from the bottom. Three meerkats looking left. And it looks to be a mountain goat. So I've got six items to go down the bottom. Level one, I'm going to leave that last one there. And a bat flying. A kitten peering across a bit of wood. I'll finish this last one and then go check the help because it looks like we've got some family of swans in a lake. I don't know whether it's, yeah, it looks to be color specific, colored with it. Move the mouse or touch the screen to erase the area and discover the background. And we've got some credits for some of the images. Credits for a lot of the images. That's right, so it's interesting. I've got a mess all over this one. I'll try that. I'll go back and then Okay, so I can no, I'm not I wouldn't call it a bug. Though that I'm not sure about. So it if I came back from the help and it the mouse stayed over it and didn't do it well. Now if I take it off then and put it back on, it works. But yeah, okay, it looks like some of them might there might be a slight maybe random delay. So we've got a cheetah lying on the ground licking its lips, you could say. It's got its tongue out. And I'll work my way through the middle. I'm not too sure what this is. Some type of monkey, maybe. The nose looks distinctive, and I haven't, don't recognize it. But it's got a little baby there, and it's eating some sort of vegetable. Let's see what um, your options of go to the next level. Yeah, I'll swap it over to manual. So it looks like we're going random based on what's happening. Another type of monkey. And it looks like once. Um, I'm not sure what the levels are, because usually when you go across a level, it gets harder. Oh, well, it's not. I'm guessing as long as I can. Clear the level, I shouldn't worry too much about why it does or it doesn't. Let's go back to automatic but it does reset oh if i can finish up on the sixth level i'll be happy it's okay and mark it as complete i could go back and do a complete playthrough or rejoin but for this yeah it doesn't seem that important it's not like i'm Recalculating somebody's tax, and we've got to do certain steps in certain order.
Okay. I'm not sure I'd consider it a bug, but if I go double up and then back. So I'm going to go down two and then back up. And it doesn't pick up the, the, um, uh, so that's, this is pretty much if I was going to have a bug, I'd say that's my first bug. I can have a mouse hover and it not complete. But given the impact of it, I just move the mouse back off it again and then move it to it. It um can can we can proceed. So I uh, I'd call it a very low priority and very low severity bug. Almost to the point where I'm not even sure I'd raise it. Um but I am for the sake of things going to put through a note. Yeah, certainly repeatable. Oh well, it's, it's, I've still got to give um, good credit to the developers. It's, yeah, if the choice was um, ship it or don't ship it, then I'd definitely ship it. And I'll try repeating it again. So I've got a status board that I'm using to keep track of this project. It's like a scrum um, task board where there's activities in to do, in progress, and done. And this one, there's another one called follow up work required, and this one's going to find its way into that. And I'll just put a note in the final report. But, um, it's still going to be we're doing it it just might be yeah it's the um not quite have you tried turning it off again have you tried moving it off the cursor and then moving it on again so even if it does go away it still can that's right Maybe it's actually working as intended, but um, that wraps up this one.